this is the best one personally for me this is maybe the best clip out of all because this i've said before kind of reminds a lot of my friends i used to grow up with in school who used to kind of lie about stupid things like having certain computer computer consoles and the funny thing about those kind of lies which i never really understood back then oh no the, the funny thing about those kind of lies back then actually was that there was a big culture of like going to each other's houses to kind of go and play because back then we didn't really have computer consoles or video games that you could play online i think the first one that came out might have been like a dreamcast or something but everything else you kind of had to like go to your friend's house to go and play so you couldn't just lie and say that you had a nintendo a sega and whatever a playstation because if someone came around your house they would see or if you lied and had the games you know what i mean um and some people did and obviously they got caught out. So Brendan reminds me a lot of that kind of person. But that sort of lie when you've got computer games makes sense when you're like five to fucking 13 years old. You're awkward. You're in school. You've got no friends. Um, you want to just be cool. You want to feel like you belong. So you just start making up lies to make people be impressed with you and shit, right? So I kind of get it. But when you're like a 40 plus year old man with two kids like and a wife, surely you have to kind of chill out with the lying and this is one of example of it this is like kind of elite navy seal level levels of lying to me so let's play this clip brendan shaw pretending or like lying about knowing the fucking rock absolutely horrendous he fight right let's keep it with that yeah. the whole he got he's like 18 man tournament <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> give me your top 18 like no 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 just who would you the fight, way you eh? develop talent is <laughs> <laughs> we'll start a feeder program, yeah. right? Females only, dude, because we got to give back to yeah. them. Um, um, I'd fight The Rock. <laughs> we'd oh, do man. numbies. Numbies. I'd beat the shit out of The Rock. You yeah. think so? You would beat the shit out of The Rock. Are you serious, Eric? Oh, you... Oh, you watched oh, this guy believes Zorro or where the fuck he's in. You think you'd beat me up? This guy believes First wrestling. First of all, do you think that The Rock was in Zorro? Yeah. I don't know. I don't you watch any of You guys are both big dummies right now. You think he would be in Zorro? He's more of a dummy, though, right? I would love if he was in Zorro. I don't even big so doofus in the fucking dude. You would be like, shit like, out of like the rock. no one would know whoever his other character yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That he's yeah, not yeah. Zoro. Yeah. He's walking around like Zoro is like with a bald head. Yeah, just, yeah, yeah. just fucking yes. dude. And he's like, who is he's this like, guy? This is Zoro. And then he just comes later. You're like, wait, where's your Zoro shit? Can you smell what Zoro's cooking? <laughs> you're like, is this the rock? The point is, you got to do numbies. No, do numbies. I don't want to do numbies. I just want to fight. Do I want to fucking fight? Who? I feel like you got a long list. How no? tall is The Rock? 6'2". <laughs> yeah, no. He's 6'2". Yeah. I've been in an elevator room. Is he a big yeah. dude? Like Which Compared only, to you, how big you is two, he? Though, right? You guys are like... Now look, 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 look. Look his head working in overtime. He, met, he, tr he had to mention that The Rock's height, but also had to mention it with the backing of like, you know, insinuating that he's seen him. Then saying, you know, I've met him. We'll be able to live together. Then Eric says, how big was he, stature-wise? And then Chris Alea kind of gives him a setup by saying, you guys will probably live like this. So immediately he's like, okay, let's jump to the more um, egregious lie that will make me look cooler. I was going to live with him alone. Do you know what I mean? He's kind of processing where to lie. Where should I go? Should I talk about his overall body shape and size from afar? Or should I make it seem like we were closer next to each other in close proximity? He goes for obviously the latter. It was just a, no. It was just two of us out of out of. Did you say fight. anything? Just what's up? Sup, the rock he fan. He said what? Said he was a fan. I said I want to fucking fight you. He's okay, not. I, all of that sounds made up. Yeah. No. We, <laughs> what about John Cena? <laughs> I'm so glad Crystalia called him out. I'm so glad we were in the lift together. He said he was a fan. In my opinion, I always think Brendan Schaub's lies. They've always got a thread of truth. So I do think at some UFC event or something to do with the UFC or something to do with Showtime, I'm sure Brendan must have crossed paths with or seen The Rock far away somewhere, like in his vicinity. I'm sure it happened. But if you would have seen him, he would have taken a picture of him, right? The guy is a fucking media whore anyway. He loves the clout and shit. He would have taken a picture. There would have been a picture of him and The Rock on social somewhere, you know, to prove that they were kind of in the same vicinity. But I don't think they spoke. I think he saw him and now he's trying to fill in the gaps of lies, personally. So I think that that's, the that's the truth of it. He probably saw him from afar. Maybe there was a head nod exchange at best. But this whole like interaction of like he knows who I am and I'm a, he's a fan, like what? So he's a fan of T5K. 
He's a fan of your appearances on the Joe Rogan experience. He's a fan of your comedy. Like, he's a fan of your fucking UFC breakdowns and shit on Shub Show or Below the Belt back then. Like, come on, let's be real. But I'm glad that Chris Alea called him out. I want to play that one more time because that Chris Alea call out was good. He's trying to post it to that. I said, what? Let's hear it one more time. Like, Which compared only, to you, how big you is you? though, right? You guys were like... It was just... A, no, it was just two of us out of, wow. out of Did UFC. Did you say fight. anything? Just what's up? Sup, The Rock. He, fan. he said what? He said he was a fan. I said, I want to fucking wow. fight you. He's okay, not... I, all of that sounds made yeah, up. Yeah, no... <laughs> All of that sounds made up. <laughs> I fucking love it. It's such an unnecessary lie, though. I don't understand why you'd lie about her. Like, again, it's just him positioning himself, wanting to be like super famous. Like, you're not that famous. No one believes you are that famous to have the attention of the Rock. And even if you did have the attention of the Rock, we just don't believe you. Like, it's just as simple as that. Really, it's just impossible to believe. <laughs> it's just one of those things. So. You'd rather just not say it, you know? Just don't say it. Just leave it as it is, personally. Um, but hey, what do I fucking know? What do I fucking know?